Hey, it's all Frog here. Let's play GeoGuys here. It is Saturday time for the African Excursions. This is, I believe, number 58 in the series of African Excursions. We find ourselves on a boat. I should really should remember where boat view is, because, boy, it's not in a lot of places. These four minutes are completely wasted. I don't think there's any point in getting for a clue. I just have to try and remember where the hell the freaking boat view is. Um, it's outside of Madagascar. It's outside of Tanzania. It's outside of... Mayotte Comoros, I believe. It's outside of Mauritius. Um, I think most of it, though, is outside of Zanzibar. Like, in this area. So that's where I'm going. No, this one was in Madagascar. See, it's just crazy different places. I only get a thousand points for that. Jesus, Africa is huge. Gorgeous location, though. On we go. Um, boo, 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 I'm guessing. Which side of the road are you on, car? All right, we are driving left. <laughs> Country restaurant. Falcon Rock. Come stop by the Falcon Rock. Maybe you can have some Falcon breakfast. Nope, this is South Africa. You don't get a place like that. <laughs> that name does not exist in Lesotho. So we're in South Africa, probably by Lesotho, if I were going to make a guess, which I'm going to have to in about 3 minutes and 20 seconds. Wherever Flat Rock is. In the meantime, we're going to pretend we're 90 and just click randomly down locations and magically get to a, a sign that says, here you are, which is what we just did. Um, we are north of Port Elizabeth. We are south of Utenage, whatever. It's 102 in the 334. Port Elizabeth is right there. The 102, of course, runs parallel to the 2. Where are you? There you are. There's the 102. There's Utenai. So we are here. There's Falcon Rock. My god, we might actually get a good score. We'll only be off by 5 to 10 points. 3 points! Oh, we were actually on the 102. What a horrible sense of, of view I had right there. Weird. I bet this is going to be a 40 minute episode because I'm so fast through the first two guesses and it's just going to be brutal for the rest of the way. Okay. Um, oh, I think we're on a Canarias. This kind of looks like Spanish road construction, but we'll, we'll see. Cool. Yeah, I totally wanted to go back this far. This is going to be awesome. That might have been a waterfall. Nope, just just sunlight. Warning, danger. Falling rocks use road at own risk. That's in English. This is weird. Are we on Malta? And I'm running through my head of the African nations that speak... English. They're mostly in South Africa. Where's the sun? Oh, the sun is in the north. Where the hell are we? Thanks for that camera shot. I'm a little terrified about this whole thing. I don't think those nets are enough for the rocks, man. I really wish I could find a car on the road and not just pulled off the road. Hungry? Grab a Snickers. Road closed. Used to be left hand drive. Water is to the west. Is this Cape Coast? Which I don't think is an official name for it, but you know what I mean. Are we near Cape Town? Like, you know what I'm talking about. 
Like we're in this thing. The road doesn't look windy enough for that. This one does, though. Chapman's Peak Drive? Maybe. Be our guest. That was a joke, by the way, about the 40 minute stream, because obviously the, the maximum it could be is 15 minutes longer, plus some extrapolation and talking on my part. Because it's not like I'm going to pause the timer. I don't even know how to pause the timer. I don't think you can. Bollocks and a half. That was exactly what I needed was that damn sign. I clicked right past it. Ugh, oh, cranky. Can we can we not? Well, we don't have time. Alright. That's not, oh, we were that's where we were. That's a good guess. I passed some sign. Probably would have been fantastic. I feel good about that though. Ooh, we're in a photos field by Muhammad Atef. Um interesting. Rocks? I'm assuming you can't click anywhere. It's a gorgeous photosphere, though. Wow, what a great camera. I have some four-wheelers there and a little bit of a circle. Got a wall here. Looks like exercise equipment. It almost looks like it's set up to be an archaeological dig, but I don't think it is. That's like your typical trash heap. And there's just people that live around here? Maybe? Well, if we trust, the sun is slightly in the south. I mean, I'm expecting to say this is Tunisia. Water would be to the south as well, though, if that's the case. Uh-oh. If we trust the compass, Rose. That being the case, I'd say we're in Somalia. Which the photospheres are outside of Mogadishu. I don't like this. I think we're wrong. We were. We're actually in Egypt. Outside of uh, Nebg. Yeah. It's a nice photosphere. Just didn't know where it was. Uh, and then I think we find ourselves in Ghana. Looks very Ghanaian with all of the business going on right here. We are driving on the right hand side though. Don't they drive on the left in Ghana? Maybe not. This is a God-first key-cutting service. Ooh, I mean, like, so what's the key-cutter going on about God? Because they don't make keys for criminals? I mean, you know what I'm saying? Peter Holdbrook. Senior high school. Almina. That's two things that say Almina. We're in Ghana. Oh my god, Ghana has a Cape Coast. It's crazy. I did not know that. Alright. Cape Coast is a city. Almina is a city outside of Cape Coast. Beautiful. There you have it. That is a very quick and dirty African excursion. What a glorious, glorious day. I had a lot of fun playing that one, actually. There was some five really great locations, I think. I don't think any one of them was, was particularly bad. Um, the photospheres are obviously difficult because that's that's how they are. But frankly, I, I feel good about this, and, and I liked uh, going through it, and I liked in, uh, playing around with it, and hopefully you guys liked it, too. If you did, click the like button. Subscribe to the channel to stay updated to everything that happens. Until next time, cheers.